Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is another Crystal Council unboxing and this one is for the month of December. I feel like my Crystal Council videos that I do are always late in the month or I'm like doubling up on the boxes that I'm unboxing. Um, but honestly, it's just because I'm not super hard on myself um, as far as like getting these videos out for Crystal Council particularly, just because the Crystal Council as a subscription box, if you're not familiar, is personalized. At least the box that I get, which is the apprentice size box, um, is completely personalized depending on the answers that I put on the survey at the beginning of the month. So nobody's going to have the same exact box as me unless they like fill out the exact same questions that I did on my survey and have the exact same things going on in their life as I do, our boxes are all going to be different. So that's why I'm not super hard on myself being a little late with this box for this month. My lighting's a little different today. I'm switching it up. It's also very late. I'm trying to do this before I have to go to sleep because I'm working tomorrow. Yesterday was Christmas. Um, I wasn't working, but I worked Christmas Eve. I worked today and I'm working tomorrow. So this video probably won't go up until Sunday or Monday or maybe tonight if I'm like really feeling at it about like, you know, getting things done, but I am not planning on editing this tonight. It's just been really crazy. I've had a very crazy time of year. I work partially retail, I guess. Um, and then partially I work in the web department for the company that I work for. So I'm like seeing a little bit of the Christmas craziness and it's been chaotic the past couple of weeks. Luckily I wasn't in it too much. I just started my new job a couple weeks ago, but I still got a taste of the Christmas craziness. Um, and it's been nuts and I'm sure it's not going to slow down very much. I'll be at the mall tomorrow and it's just literally crazy. If anybody's worked retail during the holiday season, you know what I mean. Um, but yeah, I'm excited for things to slow down a little bit and finally have a chance to breathe. I'm super excited to see what's in this. I feel like I forget about this when it's just sitting on my floor. I mean, when I used to get the Crystal Council, I've gotten it for you know quite some time now. I used to like want to dive right in and I would like film right away. And now since I've gotten it for so long and I'm around, I'm around like rocks and crystals and stones all day for my job, I'm just like, eh, I'll get to it. Like I'm not like as excited to open it up as I used to be. I'm still excited to get it, but I'm not as like, urgent if you know what I mean but that's why this baby has been sitting on my floor for quite some time but it gets to be open today and I'm excited to see what's inside and this is what it looks like come on <laughs> crystal council December newsletter there's always a newsletter I feel like I gloss over that I never read it honestly even after I'm done filming I never end up reading these things um, but I probably should it talks about lunar events um, zodiac transitions then it says on the back Share a crystal with a friend. One of your exclusives this month is a handmade crystal carrying satchel. We work with a small business in Tibet that helps employ local villagers to craft these beautiful bags. Inside, we've included an extra stone, which they, sell, they tell you right on here, is red jasper, which is a grounding crystal that helps connect you deeper with Mother Earth. It says either keep this crystal for yourself or share it with a friend who you think could use its energies. That's really cute. That is in this little box or box, what am I saying? This is in this little bag here. Um, there's a little red jasper. Oh my God, this bag is so cute. You like pull, oh, and do you pull these to close it? Yes, oh my God, how cute. You pull it this way, you get it. Let me get this out. I'm like too interest, like interested in the bag. Um, let's see, <laughs> this is what it looks like. Little red jasper. I have plenty of jaspers in a bunch of different varieties. Um, but Jasper's a really great stone to have. I actually think that I want to keep this. I'm getting ideas now. I think I want to keep this um, for a giveaway. Let me know what you think about that. I'm almost at a thousand subscribers and I'm super excited about that. I've had a lot of new people come and subscribe to my channel lately. So welcome if you're new here. Um, but maybe I'll keep this and include it in part of a giveaway. Let me know what you think. Would you guys like a giveaway once I hit a thousand subscribers? Because I feel like I want to do that. And maybe this will be one of the items that's in it. I don't know yet. Next that I see is the 2021 moon phase calendar. It's super nice that they include something like this. Basically what it does is it kind of just goes through all of the months and the date that the full moon will be, as well as the specific name of the full moon. Every full moon has its own name. So that's really nice that they include this. I had, um, I don't have it right now. I took, I didn't even bother putting it up in our new apartment, but in our last place, you can see it in my room tour. I had this really beautiful um, phases of the moon like calendar. It was like a lunar calendar for 2020 that I kept right by my altar space. And you can see it there. I got it off of Etsy. It was super cute. Um, so this is like that, but in like a very 
condensed version. It only says when the full moons are, um, which is very helpful if you practice or in general, if you just want to know when the full moons for 2021 will be. The first stone I see is aquamarine and it's a raw piece of aquamarine. I absolutely love getting raw stones in this box. Super nice getting it in a raw form because I feel like mostly when I see aquamarine, it is a tumbled stone or like faceted in jewelry. So it's really nice to have a raw aquamarine, especially because I'm connected to it a ton because it is my birth stone. Aquamarine establishes a clear connection between the heart and throat chakras. This stone only allows one to speak from the heart in words of the highest truths. The water element within the stone allows a calming feeling to arise when one communicates genuinely how they feel. The beauty of the stone is the pure communication that comes with it. Aquamarine can take an argument and turn it into a talk while also being able to turn tears into laughter. We recommend this stone to any teacher, therapist, or public speaker. Wow, this is super pretty. It's super cool. You can see little like rainbow inclusions in it. And it's like the perfect palm stone. I love that. I love the colors. Oh, so pretty. This stone is red quartz. When one begins to expand their knowledge about themselves, they will truly understand the strength and willpower they possess within. These dominant features have always been with us but have gone dormant with time and lack of use. One must awaken these abilities that define us and use them for the betterment of themselves and society as a whole. Learn how to incorporate red quartz into your meditation routines and begin tapping into this vital essence needed to restart your engines. As you become more comfortable with this crystal, begin working with it and observe minor traits about yourself coming back to your life. It looks so cool with like light shining through it. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see that because there's no light behind me. Let me see if I can do it with my phone. Look at how cool it looks with like light shining through it. That's like what I'm seeing because there's light on me. It just looks so cool. I love this. And the final two stones are the tumbled ones and they come in this little red bag. Cinnabar is a transformation stone that could push one on an external expedition of truth, change, and self-discovery. Its potent energies engage our root and sacral chakras, connecting the two and enhancing the external benefits. The attachment to the useless materials around us will cease to exist. All of your remaining life force energy will be turned directly in line with one's true higher self. The path with which you set on will only become more easily understood as you meditate and tap into Cinnabar's energy. One will become more in touch with their spiritual body. This will allow our spiritual body to make decisions rather than our clouded minds that are so easily distracted. Tree agate is an exceptional stone that helps assist your connection with nature. We recommend taking the stone into an outdoor area to fully bind with its energies. Rooting yourself down to the physical will provide you with new and enlightening ideas that you can bring into action. Oftentimes, we are the only ones holding ourselves back, but with a grounded mind, we can break that mold. Mother Earth's energies are here to provide you with all the comfort and care you need, and tree agate helps that bond. I'm going to quickly read what it says on the top of my scroll. It says, winter is the time when darkness outweighs light. When the days are short and the weather changes, try not to let those external factors change your attitude or behavior. Seasonal depression is very much an issue, an issue, but what people forget is that their perception matters most. This darkness is conjured by Mother Nature to allow you to reflect and look within. Embrace the negative thoughts and transmute them into positive reality. Use the tools included inside to help guide you there. This month, we've crafted your box around happiness, transformation, anxiety, relief, and growth. Just to give a little bit of context, I want to share with you guys what I put down on the survey, and it'll kind of show how accurately they kind of match what the box is crafted around um, compared to what I put down on the survey. The first question is, what are some attributes you would like to attain? And you are able to select up to, I think it is five um, of the options that they have. It's multiple choice. I put joy and happiness and balance, transformation and calming and clarity. The next question is, what are some areas in your life you would like to work on? And I said anxiety and depression. And the last part is an open-ended portion. And it says, if you have any information you would like to provide us with, please comment below. That's when you could open up a little bit if you want to share anything else. You really don't have to get too detailed into your personal life. Um, they don't need that in order to craft your box. It just helps them better to select things if they know what specifically you're looking for. If you're going through something, if you are trying to accomplish something, it helps for them to pick knowing what you're trying to attain, if that makes sense. I think they definitely focus more on the um, multiple choice that's what i'm looking for the multiple choice answers that i put rather than the open-ended one because i didn't really give them that much to work with as far as typing something out myself 
I still think they did a really great job. Um, I know Cinnabar is in there. Um, and I was literally just talking to one of my coworkers and they said Cinnabar is their favorite stone to work with ever. So I'm super excited to have that. Um, I'm always very happy with the stones that I get from Crystal Crown. So I know in my last video, I said I wasn't sure if I was going to continue my subscription. Now that I work at a shop that literally sells stones and crystals and I'm around them all day, I also get a discount. So I um, have decided I'm not going to continue this after January's box. I'm going to cancel my subscription. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd update you guys on that. I still do love the Crystal Council. Honestly, I think if you are going to get any type of crystal subscription box i totally recommend the crystal council i do not get these sent to me for free i pay for these myself i've been paying for them for myself for well over a year at this point um, i just really do love the company i love the concept i love that it's personalized and the stones are really great quality um and yeah they're coming from a good source like their stones are amazing so i definitely recommend this if you're interested in like a crystal council <laughs> a crystal council subscription box if you're interested in a crystal subscription box i definitely recommend considering crystal council um i can't speak to any others but i can say that this one is really amazing and i have loved getting it that is it for today's video um i don't know what my next one will be i have a couple requests some amazon favorite requests other um, requests about um, my life living in salem things that i recommend to do here um, in general if you have any other requests for me let me know i definitely want to tackle them um, in the next couple of weeks um, i'm pretty sure the next videos that i record will be requests that i've gotten just because i want to make sure that i'm giving you guys content that you really want so let me know if there's anything else that you want. I will do, be doing more informative videos. Somebody had asked if I could do a video about tarot. So I definitely will be trying to tackle any recommendations before I try to come up with something myself because I just want to make sure I'm giving you guys something that you actually want to see. So that is it for today's video and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.